Hey guys, Mike from CoachMikeMcDonald.com here. And are you looking for an effective way to grow your business through Facebook groups? Well, today's video, I'm gonna walk you through how to find targeted Facebook groups in your niche and how you can post in them to generate more traffic, leads, and sales. So stay tuned. So first things first, Facebook groups can be a great place to really market your business, uh, advertise your blog, post content that serves that audience. And you know, obviously you don't wanna be spamming in these different groups, but depending on your niche, it can be a great place to both network and find great people to work with, but also share your blog posts and share your content. And I routinely use this to generate a ton of leads for my business. And so you can do the exact same thing. So couple things to keep in mind. The first step is really to find targeted groups for your niche. So what you basically do is you come up here in the search bar and let's say you are in health and fitness. So I'm just gonna type in fitness. So when we do this, now that we're on this page, we can actually just come over here to where it says groups and you'll just click on that. Now what's awesome is these groups are all going to be related to fitness and to the niche. And so you can sort this by public groups, by closed groups, um, depending on what you're posting in there. If you don't necessarily want everyone uh, in your news feed to basically see what you're posting, you can focus on closed groups, but public groups are great too. People can see you posting your content. So if you have a big friend list that is targeted, uh, that is in your niche already. If you're promoting your business, for example, on Facebook a lot, and you have a lot of connections with that, a public group could be a great option to go with. Um, outside of that though, it's pretty simple. You just go through and you'll click on join groups. Uh, this isn't really my specific niche, so I'm not gonna do that. So let's actually go into one uh, that would be beneficial to me. So I'll do like online marketing, because I help people. Uh, grow and scale their businesses through that. So I can skip to groups, which I'm already under, and now I can find different groups. And so what's crazy, again, business owners, entrepreneurs, startups, again, that can be a great place to market my business and teach people skill sets, marketing strategies, everything like that. So I can go ahead and join this group. Now, you can see here, some groups are gonna pop up where they uh, request you to answer different questions, uh, put in a little bit about yourself. Um, I need to register on this site, so I don't know if I'm necessarily gonna want to actually go do that. So I will leave this page and cancel this request. So you never really know what's gonna pop up on these different groups. But again, online marketing group, let's see what this one is. Yeah, so this one didn't require any uh, questions or anything that I had to fill out. So that could be a good one. Um, internet marketing, work from home, cool, I'll join that promoting sales and growth, awesome. So let's see. Um, you have to comply, great, each day. So this is like a themed group where you have to post specific things. So I don't know if that's necessarily what I wanna do, so I'm not going to do that. So I'm just gonna unrequest this home business opportunities, what offering, coaching and training for marketing. I'm just gonna put my website here. And we're good to go. So again, you can come in here, go through these different groups and join them and find very targeted ones for your specific niche. So again, whatever it is that you type in this top bar, you can find different groups that are specific to your niche, your industry. And then again, like I said, it's a great place to network, provide value, serve that audience. So I'll give you a couple examples as well as what you can actually do in this group to actually start bringing in business. So I can just click on my home here, go to groups, so I can see what we've got over here. And then I can just simply scroll down. So let's say I want to go to affiliate marketing, work from home. That's one of my niches. That's what I work in. So one example of a post that you could do is basically asking a question in relation to your target market's pain point. So think of how you can serve that niche, how you can help that industry, 
you know, maybe you have products, services, a coaching program, whatever the case might be. So again, one of the things that I help people do is basically generate leads and sales online through social media. So for example, I can hop over here and say, you know, I'm just curious if you've been posting about your business and getting no engagement. Drop a me if you're getting nothing. And so I like to also go through with one of these kind of neat backgrounds that they give you. So just find one that's appropriate. Typically I'll just use like a colored one here. And then I can actually copy this because I'll post this in a few groups. And I just simply post. And so the groups that you go in can be hit or miss sometimes. So I'm just gonna kind of go post in five different groups here real quick. And so some groups I'll post a post like this and get nothing. And then other groups I'll get 50, 60 comments on it. So it can be a great way uh, to do this. So there's a lot of ways to create engagement and find people in your niche, in your target market, following this strategy. And again, what's cool is obviously people that comment on this kind of post can be helped with what you offer, right? So in this case, for me, if people comment saying that they're not getting engagement, I can show them some strategies and tips and systems on how to get more engagement. So it's a pretty simple strategy. Let's say, for example, you're in health and wellness, you could, and you promote like a weight loss or nutrition product. You might say something along the lines of, you know, I'm just curious how many of you have been trying to eat right and exercise, but just can't seem to lose the weight, you know, drop a me if you're, you know, struggling. Simple things like that. So you take your target market, you take your industry, what their struggles are, what their pain points are, and then you just create a question post based around their pain points and then post it in the group. So that, that could be a great way to do it. So I've done a few there. Um, another option you could do is share your blog posts, share your website. Uh, I would not recommend sending people directly to a sales page with this or your specific like affiliate link, for example, if that's the case, uh, that kind of pushes people away. It doesn't really attract them to your business. So, you know, it could go to a lead magnet. I found too, though, that a lot of times Facebook will label this as spam just kind of automatically, which I think is kind of dumb, but whatever, that's what they do. So typically you want to send them to like a blog post or something valuable, a YouTube video. And then obviously don't go overboard with this. I, I typically will do maybe four to five posts every hour or so as I'm around. And that seems to be a safe zone. Uh, Facebook will also kind of uh, see what your regular activity levels are. So if this is out of the norm for you, maybe do one or two an hour and post in that amount. Uh, again, same thing with joining groups. Don't go overboard with this as you're finding targeted groups in your niche. Uh, just add two, three, four, five uh, every few hours. You know, maybe your first day, first week or so, limit it to five to 10 groups that you actually request to join a day. And again, it really compounds over time, which is great. So you have a lot of groups that you can go through. So you're not just posting in the same groups over and over and over again. But again, you can do this on an ongoing basis. So this is a great strategy to generate free traffic. Uh, it's pretty targeted as well. Sometimes it's maybe not necessarily the most quality, depending on what groups you're in. You know, you'll see that there's some groups that are more spammy than others. And so that can be good and bad. You can maybe typically just post like blog posts in those groups. But at the same time, if everybody in this group is just really spamming their products, spamming their opportunities, spamming their business, when you ask like a pain point question, like I showed you a little bit earlier, that really stands out. And that's really going to attract a lot of people. So like I said, I've done this, you know, I do this run a regular basis. And, you know, sometimes I'll get a couple comments here and there. Other times I'll get 50, 60, 70 
plus comments on a post like this. So it's a very great strategy to generate traffic, to bring in leads, to grow your business through social media. So again, to find a targeted group, uh, just to really recap, you type in uh, a question or you know your industry, your niche, uh, to find those specific groups. So let's say um, I was looking for real estate. Maybe I sold a course on real estate um, prospecting. So I could go in groups, type that in. And then I can see, you know, real estate investors, maybe that's my niche, you know, real estate inv investing. If you're an employee, a real estate investors group, real estate agents and friends, right? So there's so many groups out there and so many niches, so many industries, but this is gonna be a really great way to find your niche, find your specific industry. And then again, you can just simply join these. And then over time, they really build up and you can share your value, share your content, and then just network with people in these groups as well. So another cool strategy is I could go into a group. So I'll go back to, some of them that I'm actually in. So it's in my niche and target market. So we'll do groups. Let's do online business marketing. So you could actually go through and find posts of people that you think look sharp, that look professional, maybe that aren't super spammy. And then you could actually reach out and network with these people. So for example, I could come down here, scroll through, find a post. Actually try and find one that is in English, for example. And I could, you know, like this, comment on it. This person's doing a live, so I could like this and then set up a comment, go and find a, a mess, send them a message. Put a link in new tab. So let's like the post. Send a message. Maybe Jessica. All right, so pretty simple. You know, hey, Jessica, how's it going? I saw your post in a business group we're both in. Figured I'd reach out. Saw you're out in South Dakota, right next door. I'm out in Minnesota. You know, just curious, are you from there originally? So again, nothing too crazy, just being a normal human. I like the post. I'm gonna just comment, Jessica. Sent you a message. but it may have gone to your message quest holder since we aren't friends. It's pretty simple. So again, another cool strategy, you can network with people that, that look sharp uh, that you see in these groups and you know, is it gonna turn into business? Who knows, you know, it might just start a conversation, make a new friend, networking. So again, another great strategy is to be, you know, adding at least 10 new people a day or reaching out to at least 10 new people a day in your niche to kind of build that target market to build that audience of quality uh, people in your net, in your niche, in your industry uh, that could potentially be a fit for your offers and for your business. So again, these are some different strategies to build your business in groups, to find targeted groups uh, for your niche and for your industry to market your products, to network in and generate leads and sales with. So again, guys, hopefully you got some benefit and value out of this video. If you did, 
feel free to comment and share. So again, definitely let me know below the video some other strategies or, or tips that you like using for building your business through Facebook groups. I'd love to hear about them. But again, if you haven't done so yet, definitely subscribe to my channel here to get more tips and training to help you grow a profitable business from home and then turn on those bell notifications as well. And then also, if you are struggling, maybe you're not generating the leads you'd like to be, but you'd really like to start building your business more successfully through social media, I'll put a link below this video for a free lead generation bootcamp I put together uh, to really teach you the ins and outs of generating targeted leads for your business and growing your business on social media. So if you'd like to access that, you can click the link below this video, or again, head on over to coachmikemcdonald.com forward slash five day coaching. Again, that's coachmikemcdonald.com forward slash five day coaching. But again, guys, thanks so much for tuning in. We'll talk to you more soon.